Hello YouTube, I'm back in the car. Oh, feels like home. Now let me tell you a couple of things. I haven't been in the car all week because I had a week off work. And unfortunately, I've only got a few weeks left of work. If you don't know, I quit my job. Now I'm staying there as long as I need to. I will not leave that place until I know that I can leave it knowing that it will be fine. Because that, you know, it's been my baby for years. I've put my blood, sweat and tears into that place. And I can't turn my back on it, not knowing if it's gonna be all right or not, you know? Also, that my boss is also my mate, you know? You don't leave your mates in the shit. And I know that he needs some help and, you know, I'm gonna be there for him. So yeah, the car videos are gonna slowly become less frequent because I'm not getting in my car to drive around killing the environment and wasting fuel for the sake of making a video that I could make in my shed. Yes, I'm gonna get 100 comments going, why aren't you in your car? Get back in your car, I'm in my mum's car. You know, sh you know, what the fuck? You know it's gonna happen, don't you? But it is what it is, over time people will start to learn, right, this is how things are now. The content will still be the same. I'll still be shouting, screaming, calling you all motherfucking cunts and everything. But a good thing about me being in my shed now, is there's a lot more I can do. I don't know if you watched my video previous with the auto-tune. I found this app and I fucking had so much fun playing with it. I, honestly, I made that video and then I stayed on it for about another hour recording shit. It's amazing how auto-tune can make your voice sound good. Oh, and the fact that you don't even really got, you haven't even got to sing. You just say words and they come out making sense. Or they sound like they make sense. <laughs> I did put that video up on my uh, TikTok backup account and flop. Most videos flop on that account. It's because I don't post on there frequently enough. So I've been doing three videos a day for TikTok. Where I think I'm going to uh, cut that a bit short. You see, I'm now going to make sure I put a video up on YouTube every other day. Uh, two to three posts a day on Instagram, including one video made for Instagram, a video made for Facebook, not just shared. I'm gonna make sure I get on Snapchat and put stories on there every day. And then I've got the Reddit, the Pinterest, the Tumblr, the Twitter. So TikTok, this main account, my Lord K account, which is now Lord K if you didn't know, not Lord Kianta. I'm gonna be putting two on there a day now, and at least one on my backup account every day to try and help build the momentum up on that account. Hopefully I can do two and two. All depends on what ideas I can come up with at the, you know, at the time. I was sitting there last night trying to come up with ideas for TikTok this morning. I filmed them now, but I fucking struggled. Like sometimes you just, your brain's dead. The thing is, because I had to force those ideas out, once I've edited them, I might not even post them because if they're not good, they're not good and I can't post crap. Well, actually saying that, I normally say, if I think a video's crap, I put it on my backup account, which don't help. Because I think, I've filmed it now, I don't really want to waste it, and then, yeah, I fucked it. Oh shit, I just realised my mate rang me up before I left for work, he said, don't go this way. <laughs> oh fuck, too busy talking to you. But anyway, I know it's only Monday, but I am looking forward to this week being over. Saturday, I'm going axe throwing with Chaos Razor, my wife and his other half. And then Sunday, I'm going back to Fort Park. Now you might think, oh, but Darren, your last Fort Park review wasn't very good. Well, no, it wasn't. Now, do I take it back? No. However, it would have been a good review if I'd have been able to get the fast track tickets that I wanted. And I'm so glad I brought them. So I'm going back Sunday. I brought the fast track tickets straight after the last time I went there. Because I need to go back with the fast track tickets to be able to give it a good review. But yeah, now I've quit my job. I can't be spending money like that, you know, just on fun. If I want to go there, I have to queue, but I can't queue, so I won't go there. I can't queue, I get angry, I get stressed, it ruins my day. I know it sounds silly, but it's not my fault, I can't help it. All right, fingers crossed, my mate was wrong, and there ain't no traffic around this corner, like he said there was. Oh, fuck, it's slowing down, it's slowing down. And, yep, traffic all the way down, it's about a mile long road, great. So yeah, anyway, full part Sunday, axe throwing Saturday, can't fucking wait. I think we're going down the pub as well, Saturday evening after the axe throwing. Oh, one little thing, if you're on Twitch and you're not following me on Twitch, do you mind popping over to my Twitch? Lord underscore Kianto. It's like I'm 50 followers away from 3,000. <laughs> be nice if I could hit that this week. I'll be on Twitch again Tuesday, tomorrow, playing with Chaos Razor, Swano, and Ellie. Ellie needs a gamer name. Oh, wait, Watchful Swing is her username. I have to start calling her Watchful Swing 14. <laughs> But yeah, cunts, that's pretty much it, you know. I'm still scared about my job, like, not working. But I've got, like, Seven. Uh, he's a streamer, right? And he's just sponsored a video for me. And he's going to give away 75 stickers to go on the side of my car. And he's going to pay for them. 
and then we're just we're doing a competition on uh, TikTok. So keep an eye out for that, and you've got a chance to get on the side of my car for free. If you've already got one on there, you can still enter. Um, I'll be putting that up soon. Then I've got other people who are offering some work. Well, not so much work, but like, they're going to make stuff. I promote it to sell it, and they give me half. But like relevant stuff is going to have like my logos on or my my hashtags on and stuff like that. Another guy ring me up. Well, written, sorry, messaged me, and it was like, yeah, I sell cars, and if you want to. You know, like advertise them and try and sell them for me, and then I'll give you a cut of the money. I thought, fuck me, why? Like, why do people want to help me so much? Like, I'm not, I'm not, not saying please don't. No, no, I'm just like it's hard to understand. People care about me that much. People that haven't met me, all they've seen is a, a minute's worth of videos that I put up, and they like me, and it's a lovely fucking feeling, and it just makes me want to work harder towards my goal. Of becoming, you know, some type of mental health counsellor or something. You know, I still haven't worked out the exact route yet. I couldn't do the course I wanted to do and I was gutted and it, I thought that was it, it's all over with. I've quit my job, I can't do what I want to do. But there's going to be another way, I've got, I've, got, I've got to work it out, that's all. You know, I've got to do something. I don't quit unless I'm quitting for another goal, you know. I'm stepping forward into my future. And yeah, I'm going to take a huge hit financially, yeah, we know that. But if, if I can make other people smile and make people happy and all that shit, you know, surely that's worth more than money. It's got to be. There's got to be more to life than what I've been doing, just working my ass off every day so I've got some money in the bank so I can go down the pubs at the weekend and go on holiday once a year. But hey-ho, you know, if I am wrong, doesn't mean I can't get a job again one day. You know, I'm pretty sure there are plenty of people out there I can get in contact with and get a job next week if I had to. But, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm hoping this pays off. Because I think this this is the way to live. This is the you know I'm gonna be coming home every day. Hopefully, have helped somebody each day, knowing I've possibly saved or made a life better. Surely there ain't a better feeling than that. Anyway, cunts, I won't bore you any longer. Thank you very much for popping along and watching my uh, my weekly vlog. You know my YouTube don't get a lot of views. You know I'm not gonna hide the fact. You can see that if you wanted to. Hopefully we can uh, we can get it up there one day. I just need to uh, I need to do some collaborations with some big boys. And and now you know now my toes are dipped in the water, and people are starting to know who I am. Will bring me some opportunities. I hope. But anyway, until the next video, which I have got another one coming soon. <laughs> Kianta.